Well, first of all, I want to comment on the Nothing Burger tweet. Uh, because I think President Trump is making a big mistake in going back to say that the, tr the Russians did not interfere in our elections. And everybody agrees that they did. Uh, the entire, all the intelligence agency do. The Mr. Clapper, who he cites to say there was no collusion, is the same Mr. Clapper that says there was Russian meddling. So I think it's just a strategic mistake. And from somebody who, somebody who focuses on national security, I find it really alarming that the president of the United States will not acknowledge that our sovereignty was violated. Uh, would you expect Comey to back him up today? Mr. Comey's already backed him up on that. So if, if they, they should ask him on the record just to clarify it so that the American people can see him testify. But remember, the FBI signed up to that uh, statement, a unanimous statement that was put out in December that the Russians interfered in our elections. Igor, how much freedom does either Comey or Rogers have to, uh, to back him up as the ambassador suggests? Well, I think uh, what's important to understand is attribution is ultimately elusive in cyberspace. Uh, the Internet is uh, an anonymous place. Uh, what we understand about cyberspace operations is that they're inherently deniable. Uh, we don't go dressing up our troops in foreign uniforms and marching them into battle. That would be the exception, not the rule. But in cyberspace and cyber offensive operations, that rule is actually, that exception becomes the rule. So uh, everything that's done in cyberspace is ultimately not attributable. Uh, we've seen the WikiLeaks Vault 7 release, and I throw the door open on how digital fingerprints are ultimately fungible, uh, that false flag operations are the norm in that space. And so uh, to say that based strictly on digital fingerprints or digital forensics, we can say that Russia meddled in our elections, I think that's not enough. Uh, ultimately, we need all the other intelligence, and I'm sure that Director Comey will share some of that, or at least allude to it uh, this morning, because ultimately cyber is just not enough. You need the totality of evidence, and I think that's what we're going to have to rely on. So, so you're suggesting the smoking gun is not attainable in this, in this universe? Certainly not in cyberspace. You know, as I've mentioned, uh, cyber digital fingerprints are ultimately fungible. So we've hmm. seen uh, Vault 7. I think reading it uh, throws the door open on what CIA has been doing. And let's understand that this type of capability is firmly in the hands of over 100 countries around the world that we recognize as having offensive cyber capability. So uh, we don't, really don't know uh, what they're looking at uh, in the intelligence community. I think uh, they're probably examining the totality of evidence, all the other sources. I think human intelligence is probably paying a, a piece of it, um, uh, playing a role in it. So. Um, I don't know that we have what we have what we have in hand today is enough to make those determinations, but hopefully the testimony this morning will uh, allude to some of it. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.